to my channel. Welcome back to day number six of Vlogmas. Today is a workout. I'm pretty excited about this one. This is one that typically is done very well on my page and it is all about building the hourglass. So it's going to be a 15 minute workout for you guys, broken up into three sections. Section number one is for the legs and the booty. Section number two is for the core and the waist. And section number three is for the shoulders. So it's all about building that illusion of an X frame, the illusion of an hourglass frame. So I hope you guys are ready. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, pause the video, and also on the top right hand corner, hit the bell icon. What that will do is give you an update of every time I upload, which means you won't miss any of my workouts, my vlogs, my recipes, all of it. You'll get a little notification. I promise it's not annoying and it's very worth doing. So subscribe, bell icon, and if you don't mind, a little like as well, because it really supports my channel, guys. Okay, let's get going. You need a pair of dumbbells. I've got 5 kg, whatever works for you guys. Obviously, the heavier, the harder it is. And also, in my new display cabinet, <laughs> I have my resistance band. As you guys know, I'm obsessed with this one. It's almost wearing away now, but it's so good. I love it. Okay, I think it's a love-hate relationship. I've got the timer. Pop your resistance band on, guys. The first five minutes is actually with no break. It just runs straight through. I want you to step to the side of your mat and follow me. The timer is gonna start right now. Okay, so we're gonna sidestep. Crab walks out. When you reach the end of your mat, Squat jump, then back across again. So this is glute activation, warming up those butt muscles, working into the legs, okay? While you're here, please make sure you're pushing out against the resistance of that band to make sure it's really working. One minute on each exercise, guys. Good work. I've actually turned the aircon off in this new apartment because I was worried it would be a little bit loud for you, but now I'm regretting it. I might as well be outside. Okay, keep pushing. Amazing work, guys. 20 seconds left. You should be feeling that those legs are already feeling a little bit warm. Good work. 15 seconds. Good. 10 seconds, guys. The leg section, in my opinion, is the worst. That's why I put it first. Five, four, three, two, and one. Straight down onto the mat. No grab a weight, then come down onto the mat. Place the weight onto the pelvis, dig the heels in, lift the butt up. Good, hold there to start off with. We have a minute here. Hold and squeeze, and then pump out. Breathing control. Digging those heels in, pulling those stomach muscles in nice and tight. Really working against the resistance of that band. Good work. Keeping that butt nice and high, keeping the ribcage down. You should be feeling that the booty is burning. Well done, guys. Really good work. You still have 15 seconds left. Holding higher, squeezing. If you're not sure, look at that timer on your screen. You guys added, asked me to add it on, so I did. Last three, two, and one. Now you're gonna hold at the top, but this time on your toes. Nice and high. If you want to make it harder, add another weight on. Come as wide as you physically can and pump out. Should be feeling those butt muscles kicking in. And this is only minute number three. Wow, it burns. If you can come a little bit higher, keep going. If it's hurting your back, I want you to readjust. Come up just a small amount and go there. We've got this guy. Really nice and high. You still have 30 seconds left. Keep squeezing as wide as you can. Feeling that butt. Amazing. Come a little bit higher if you can and just hold. Hold those legs wide. A little bit wider if you can. Come on, keep pushing. Keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing. Last 10, nine, higher, eight, seven, squeeze, six, five, four, squeeze, higher, wider, and one, you're gonna hate me now. Come straight up into standing, and we're going for those X walks again, okay? This time holding the weight in close. Good work, okay? One minute at the end, mini jump. Whew. Really good work. Whew. Amazing. Oh, my hair is driving me crazy, but I'm not gonna stop to correct it in a second. Has anyone else 
get annoyed with their hair during a workout. Okay, I'm doing it. Okay. Hey, actually, that's a good point. I should probably do a little YouTube video on a few good hairstyles for the gym, because this definitely isn't one. Okay, amazing. 20 seconds, keep going. So you should be feeling this on this outer butt muscle, the glute med. This is the hourglass sculpting butt muscle, the one that we sometimes forget about. 10 seconds left. Five seconds, come on, the other end of the mat. Three, two, and one, perfect. Straight down again. This time we're going for our clan. Keep the band on if you want to, entirely up to you. Okay, from there, on your side, open the legs apart, straighten out the upper leg, move it as far forward as possible, and pump it. 30 seconds on each side. The weight, keep going, should be as far down the leg as you feel it can go. Just to really work that booty. Last five, four, three, two, woo! Straight change, guys. Onto the other side. We only have 30 seconds. Make it worthwhile. Down we come. Open the legs. Straight in. Toe down if you love if you want to make it even harder. And pump it. Good work. Just 30 seconds. Thinking about that core. Pulling in nice and tight. Five, four, three, two, woo! And one. Section one. Whoop. Section one complete going on to section two. Sorry for the small little glitch, guys. We now have a bun on the head. Much better, okay? So we're gonna start off with the feet away from the butt, but the knees still bent. Coming up into a sit-up, punch the sky, and back again. Making sure that you're rolling down segmentally. Lower back, mid back, upper back. Only when you've got that right can we speed it up, guys, okay? Really good work. Five minutes of abs, we've got this. We're gonna get those stomach muscles absolutely burning, okay? Working into that deep core and then the outer core muscles that are gonna give you, can get my words out there, gonna give you that six pack. Keep pumping, keep pushing. Just under 15 seconds. Amazing work, guys. Come on, we've got this. Five seconds, all the way. Okay, we're gonna stay at the top now. We're gonna straighten the legs out and we're gonna roll back to our biting point. Straighten those arms out as well. Make sure that the core is switched on. You should be feeling that your arms kick in as well now. We're gonna hold all the way to 30 seconds. So you have another 15 seconds. Keep holding, keep pushing. Amazing, guys. 10 seconds left. Last five, four, three, Two, now mini pulsations up and down if you need to. Bring the weight in a little bit closer to the chest. Really doesn't matter, just keep pushing for me. It's tiny movements. Breathing control. 20 seconds. Should be feeling those arms kicking in as well. We're warming the arms up for the next section. 10 seconds. I really want to work my shoulders today. I'm keeping them straight. Five seconds. Three, two, and one. Come on up into sitting now. Rolling back to your biting point now. Gently resting the feet, and we're gonna rotate side to side. Breathing through, guys. Concentrating on form. If you feel like you can make it a little bit harder, you can lift the legs up, but don't cross them, okay? Keeping them like so. We're aiming to go from a hip joint to hip joint to work into the obliques. Breathe in. You have 30 seconds left, guys. Come on. Keep pushing. Keep pulling those stomach muscles in nice and tight. 20 seconds, guys. All the way through. You're killing it. 15 seconds. Amazing. Don't give up. This is minute number three of five, guys. Thinking about your form. Pulling those core muscles in really nice and tight. Five seconds, breathing control. Two, and one. Straight into the next exercise. We're gonna come back onto our forearm and we're not gonna go for our sexy Instagram position. Instead, we're gonna get correct form by tucking the tailbone under and pulling the core in nice and tight. Double leg tabletop. Straight 
Straighten out and pull back in. Breathing control. Amazing. Really good work, guys. This is minute number four of five. Perfect. Good, 30 seconds left. We can do it. 25 seconds. We've so got this, guys. Breathing. Amazing. 15 seconds now. Don't give up. For the last 10, we're gonna try and hold. That's now, hold those legs straight. If you can, pull that core in tight. If anyone feels ambitious, for the last five seconds, lift. Three, two, and one. Straight down onto the mat now. You're gonna place the weight in between the shins. Hook one leg over the other. Come on up into a crunch and pump the arms up and down. We're finishing up with hundreds. Breathing, guys. Things to think about. We want that lower back flat in the mat. We're high up in the crunch and our eye gaze is forward in between the thighs. 30 seconds left. We can do this. Whew. Amazing, keep breathing. I'm sweating and we're nine and a half minutes into exercise. I mean, it is 27 degrees outside, but it's still hard work, okay? 15 seconds, even higher. Good, if anyone feels ambitious for the last 10, straighten the legs out. Amazing, eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, and one. Abs complete. I'm just gonna quickly pause while I grab my other weight, okay? So you want to have two weights now. Last section, upper body, okay? We're gonna start off with our V or W shape bicep curls. One minute, keeping the chest proud and open, keeping the core really nice and tight and squeezing the butt muscles. Okay, breathing control again, guys. Making sure that those shoulder blades are fixed behind you, squeezing the shoulder blades together. We're halfway. Keeping it strong and smooth. Amazing work, guys. 25 seconds left. Good. My arms are really sore. I think it's because I've been carrying so much IKEA stuff doing up the flat, 15 seconds. I have been working my arms and shoulders recently without even realizing. Five seconds left, good. Last three, two, and one. Amazing, grabbing just one weight, popping it behind the back of the head. One minute of tries, okay? Again, pulling that core in nice and tight, chest proud and open, and taking those arms into just short of extension. One minute of work. Good work, guys, I'm so proud of you. I know this isn't easy. Keeping the eye gaze forward, but slightly down, okay? The last thing we want is for your hip to be up like this. As you'll see, it causes the rib cage to flare. We want that down and strong. Okay, we're over halfway through this. Amazing. Good, 20 seconds left, guys. We can do it. 15 seconds, don't give up. Amazing. 10 seconds now. Nine, eight, seven, yes. Six, five, four, core tight. Three, two, and one. That's minute number two. My favorite slash least favorite. Taking those arms out in front. One, two, three, four, and down. And down. Okay, keep pushing for me guys. We're coming up. Oh, we're over a quarter of the way. Making sure that those arms are coming out directly in front of your eye gaze. Down here isn't working to the same extent. And equally, don't fling through the body as you come up, okay? This isn't a kettlebell swing. This is controlled. 25 seconds left. Good. We can do it. Amazing, guys. 15 seconds. Also, squeeze those butt muscles. Let's light the booty at the same time. 10 seconds. Amazing work, guys. Last three, two, and one. Wow, that burn. Okay, we're coming onto all fours now to work the shoulders 
as well as the core. Spreading the fingertips, tucking the toes under, come up, and we're gonna take the knee towards the elbow. We're in a box shape, okay? So this isn't a full mountain climber, so keep going. If we're back here, this is gonna kind of turn into a mountain climber. We wanna keep in that box shape and come forward from here. It's a lot harder than it looks, guys. Keep the control. This really works into the arms. 20 seconds left. 15 seconds, come on, keep pushing for me. Home straight now, 10 seconds. I feel boiling. Five, four, three, two, and one. Last exercise, shake those arms out. Okay, last minute, you just need one weight. Okay, we've started. We're holding the arms out in front of us, core tight, but squeeze for 10 seconds. We have four, three, two, and one. Then we twist, one, two, three, four, down, and back up again, 10 seconds. Hold strong, hold tight. We can do it. 5 kg is heavy. If you want, grab two weights. Three, two, and one. One, two, three, four, down, and back in again. We have two more rounds of this. 10 seconds. You've got this, guys. That's five seconds down. Five, four, three, two, one, two, three, four, down. Okay, last one, let's go. 10 seconds. 10 seconds, that is all. Eight, seven, six, core tight. Five, four, three, two, twist. One, two, three, four, and we are done. Wow, that was a lot harder than we probably thought it was gonna be. Portia's in the background. She's been doing, hey Portia. She's been doing some editing and filming behind the scenes and I just shouted out, it's crazy what you can achieve in like 10, 15 minutes. Guys, that was unbelievable. I'm gonna quickly grab now my protein shake because I need it to refuel, to repair the muscles because I'm going in to film another workout after this. Guys, sending you so much love. Please make sure you couple this with my other workouts. There are so many available. And also hit that share button and spread the love with some of your friends. I don't know how much they're going to appreciate you for it. You'll be like, hey, here's a workout, but it's great for us. And don't go anywhere, guys, because tomorrow is the most epic video coming your way, which involves prizes and giveaways. That's all I'm going to say. I'm not allowed to say anymore. Okay, see you guys tomorrow. Turn on the bell icon, then you won't miss it. By the way, FYI, there is a new flavor of optimum nutrition protein, and it's hazelnut. Oh my gosh. <laughs>